Hello Taurus, how are you? I hope this finds you well. So we are doing your person on your mind reading. Whoever you're thinking about, that is who this reading is intended for. Now it is a general reading, so it may not be able to resonate for all of you. And if you want something that is meant for your exact energy, then I do a personals open. And everything that you need to know will be in the description box below for you. So we are inviting your angels, spirit guides, and ancestors to come in and assist us with this reading today. So we are, Taurus, we are taking a look at their feelings, their intentions. We are looking at their next action towards you. We're looking at the challenge between the two of you and the potential outcome. The general overall energy is the four of pentacles in the reverse. You guys have a lot of reversals here. I feel like there's something here that you guys are, somebody is either that you are trying to release something that you've been holding on to, or they could be trying to release something. The magician is right under that three of swords in the reverse. So somebody could have been hoping uh, for some kind of healing or forgiveness here. Somebody could have been trying to manifest that, whether this is you or the person that you're dealing with. Somebody could have been trying to manifest forgiveness or a healing in a situation. But they may, it may have felt like it's been, it's taken too long and that it's not going to happen. Some of you guys could be getting to a space where you're trying to, to release it, that, release that desire, release that hope so that you guys can start to move forward. This could be you or the other person. Okay. Now their energy towards you, they have the hair, they have the hair font in the reverse here for their feelings. They also have the three of pentacles in the reverse for their intentions. You know, I'm going to be honest with you. It does kind of feel to me that somebody here, Taurus, they could, they could struggle with commitment or they could just be no longer wanting to commit to the situation, commit to the connection here. Three of pentacles in the reverse, they could feel like you guys are not quite on the same page or you don't want the same things. Or maybe there's this energy of not getting along well or just feeling like you're not working well together. You're not getting along. You're not wanting the same things. They have this I am working on myself card. And they also have this stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. They do have the King of Cups here in the reverse for their next action. So I do feel like this person is like putting their guard up emotionally. I feel like they're like, this is not just to you, but I feel like in love in general, I do feel like maybe this person is, you know, was hoping to heal things, was hoping to kind of manifest things with you here. And now, like when that didn't happen, I just feel like this person's choosing to you know, like, you know what, I'm going to, I don't want to be in a relationship right now. I'm going to focus on me. I'm going to figure out what I want to do, especially the three of pentacles could be a card of um, coming up with a plan and following that, you know, and I feel like this person may not know what they're creating in their life. They may not have a plan. So I feel like this person is trying to take some time for themselves to figure out what it is that they want. I feel like they're kind of closing off to love altogether here with this king of cups in the reverse and you know, the six of wands in the reverse for... Some of you guys could definitely be dealing with the Leo. You also have Taurus, Capricorn, and Scorpio here. Now, with this Six of Wands in the reverse energy as a challenge, you know, somebody just doesn't feel like this is it, this is a connection that can be successful. Maybe they feel like they can't be successful in any connection at this time. We are going to clarify these in a moment to get more information, but we do have the the strength card here for the potential outcome. So somebody's holding back. Somebody's trying to just focus on themselves, do what they need to do. The moon card, they're not really sure where that's going to lead to, but they're trying to, they're trying to just stay focused and do what they need to do. Tell me about this Hierophant. We have the Nine of Swords. So I do really feel like they are in their head about the connection. I do feel like they are upset that something isn't working out here. Because I do feel like this is something that they saw a lot of potential in. It's something that they really wanted. And maybe they felt like that's why they were trying to manifest this healing between the two of you. They wanted that opportunity. And I feel like maybe holding on to it and wanting it was too difficult for them. We have the three of pentacles. You know, letting go is hard, but holding on is hard too. And I feel like that's something that this person is seeing. They're like, you know what, maybe I just need to focus on me right now. The eight of cups is here as well. 
So they could be trying to just allow themselves to move forward, allow themselves to move on, especially if they were holding on to this connection, you know, and not allowing themselves to grieve or not allowing themselves to move forward. They have the King of Cups with the Star card in the reverse. So recognize King of Cups in the reverse, Star card in the reverse. They're closing off to love at this time because they're recognizing that they have a lot of healing that they need to do. They're recognizing they're not ready for any kind of new connections right now, that they still need to heal from the from this connection with you here. They have the Six of Wands in the reverse with the King of Swords. So they could be cutting, you know, people out. I feel like they could just be distancing themselves if they were talking to anybody else or anything like that. I feel like that is being cut off. I do feel like this person was trying to manifest something here, whether that was manifest a new connection, manifest um, some healing with you with that three of swords in the reverse. But I do feel like this person is recognizing where they are not over this connection with you. They are not ready to move on to anything new. They are putting up their boundaries. They are cutting things out of their life. I feel like this person is just trying to find the strength to finally let go and move forward. But that is what I have for you guys. Now, if this resonates, let me know. If it doesn't, check out your other placements. Everything that you need to know, whether it's about this reading, scheduling your personals, Patreon, the tarot course, all of that is in the description box below for you. And if you want personal prayers for any reason, you can just put a little prayer emoji in the comments down below and I will go through and pray for you. But if this is where we part, thank you guys for being here and supporting me and I will see you soon.